Oh, it's an electric atmosphere inside the building tonight for this Western Conference clash. James Cebulski, Ray Ferraro, ready to bring you all the details here for EA Sports. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. The Flames take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Hannafin's got it along the wing. He scores! lead. Oh, the thievery coming up with the puck on the play. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And that's denied by Markstrom. And he can't hang on after that hit. Nice zone entry from the middle. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. Tonight. Guys, back to you. 
Picked up along the boards by Barry. Can't connect! Edmonton's got control of it now here in the offensive end. His reflexes on display tonight. Pass back to the point. Scooped up along the wall by Backlund. Takes it into the slot. Makes the save. Forces the turnover in the defensive zone. Hyman's back in the play after getting a new stick at the bench. And he easily stops that one. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. More than half the period has expired. The Flames are up 3-1. Calgary's won the draw. And things start to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. Poked away in the defensive end. The Oilers take it along the wing. Takes a hit on the play. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Shillington's got it to the side. Edmonton's got control of it now from their own end. He's got a little jump. Oh, what a save! Edmonton's grabbed a hold of the puck. The Oilers have it behind the cage. And the puck's knocked loose. Calgary's got it in their own zone. The Oilers gain control of the puck. Calgary's gained possession. The Oilers gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Dishes it to Goudreau. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Takes a shot. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. That's off a stick. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. And with the buzzer, that puts a bow on the first 20 minutes of play. We've got lots more still to come. Second period action next, right here. The middle stanza is about to go. The official's ready to drop the puck. Calgary's won the draw in the neutral zone. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. The Flames have it against the wall. And makes the routine save. Stop! a little bit shaky. He makes a good save there to keep his team somewhat in the game. Let's it go! That's kicked away with a pad by Markstrom. Calgary's got it in their own zone. Hammers one! What a stop! There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Flames just recently adding to their lead. They're now up by three. The Oilers take possession off the faceoff. Quick pass to Hyman. And that's knocked away. Stays with it. Hammers the shot. Oh, what a stop. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick pass to Hyman. And now he angles it across to Pugliarvi. Calgary's got the puck in the defensive end. with a stop and a bad pass and they'll be forced to start all over again outside the offensive end Calgary's looking to break out passes up ahead from the left wing here's a shot turned aside with a glove by Smith and the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play nearing the midway mark of the period 
And we've got a 4-1 hockey game. Dreisaitl's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Passes over to Nugent Hopkins. Change up, nice change zone up. entry from the left. Calgary's got the puck along the boards. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Edmonton's got the puck. Works it across to Nugent Hopkins. Edmonton's got it across the line. Here's a shot. Big time stop. Markstrom's able to keep the score the same. He turns away a slot shot. Rips it on net, and he comes up with the save. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Well past the midway mark of this period. A lot of offense in this one, mostly from one side. We've got 4-1 to score. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. A nasty whack and the officials all over that one. Drives to the paint and they score! With the delayed penalty, everybody falls back on their heels a bit. They don't defend well and it's in their net. Edmonton's given themselves something that everybody in sports longs for. A hope here, Ray. Hope, a chance. Hey, it's here. Something. Time isn't the enemy yet. Let's it go! Oh, makes the save! That was a rocket! Scores! Anything you can do, I can do better. Wow, that can take a long bit. They give up the one goal and they go right back down the ice and score. That's really impressive work. Well, it zips on by him here, but there's no chance for him. There's so many people in front of him. He's trying to find the shooter, locate the puck, and then make a move. There's just not enough time. The Flames clearly aren't a fan of any mercy rule tonight, are they? Now, when it's your night, though, go and enjoy it. You got a few goals, go get a few more. There's going to be some nights that it doesn't happen like this. Calgary's got a hold of the puck. And just a good old-fashioned solid body check on the play. Into the offensive zone. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Fires it! What a stop as he puts out the fire! Handles the bank pass from along the boards. Fires it into the offensive zone. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Here they come on the attack. And just like that, from out of nowhere, comes up with the puck. He was left in there. Slides it over to Richie. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Here's a blast! Blocked in front. And puts it right over the crossbar. Oh, getting a little cheeky there. Here in the late goings of the period, the Flames now lead by three. McDavid's one possession. Oh, what a little stick lift on the play and comes up with the puck. Quick feed to Hyman. With possession along the wall. Takes a shot, and that goes off the player in front. The Flames gain possession along the wall. And no luck on that pass attempt. A howitzer. Turns him away! Good Shoot battle along the boards for the puck. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. And that's just out of reach. And that concludes the second period of play. Still one more period of regulation time. We'll see what happens in the third next. are set, officials are set, third period action is coming up. Here we go, third period set to get underway, simply too much to not enough at this point. Rafe scores right on the doorstep, he pounces on the rebound and puts it home.
His big rig superstar ability is that strength to protect the puck while driving it toward the net. No one was able to defend that play, and he finishes it off by lighting the lamp. Puck grab by Boudreaux. Just a simple save by Smith. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. We're still in the early stages of this period. Edmonton still down by two goals in this one. The Flames win it. Scooped up along the wall by Hannafin. Drips it and rips it off target. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck now. Tries to get it over to Pugliarvi. Moves into the slot. Great save from in tight. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Here's a short pass to Goudreau. And now it's grabbed by Kachuk. Denies him with the save. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Flames win the faceoff. Easily turned aside by Smith. And it's kicked away. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. Solid hit on the play and that knocks the puck off his stick. Change lines, come on. Quick shot. No room for that one to get through. The Oilers have it now. Moves it quickly over to Barry. Now a quick pass to Hyman. Quick shot. Denied by the goaltender. Tries to get the puck over to Hannafin. From behind the net. Here's a blast. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Moves the puck. The Oilers take possession here in the open ice. Penalty coming up here. The Flames have been handed two minutes for hooking. Man advantage unit is set. This power play's been waiting around here for an opportunity while they draw the penalty finally. And this top-rated group will make their appearance into the game. Taken along the wall by Nugent Hopkins. Tries to the crease. Oh, off the outside of the frame. Edmonton's close, but they can't get close enough. That shot hits the goalpost and stays out. Another face-off looming here on this power play. The Flames get a hold of the puck in their own end. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Here he is, wrists it on net. Made the stop on the play. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Can't connect on the pass. From center, they get into the attacking area. Let's it go. Gets in front of it. Taken by Tanev. The Flames play the long board. Zadorov ready to join the play. Calgary's PK unit comes up big as both sides are back to even strength. That's a bad time for a penalty, but they're still up in this third period. The penalty killers do a nice job for them. Smith's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. Past the midway mark in this period. While fans being treated to some offensive fireworks, it's a 5-3 game. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Slides the pass over to Nugent Hopkins. And now he moves it to Yamamoto. Here they come up along the wing. Let's get the call. The Flames will serve two for slashing. The Oilers send their man advantage unit out once more. Doesn't matter whether you've had one or 10 power plays, the fundamentals of it are the same. Win the draw, get the puck to the point, try and spread the penalty killers out. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Battling for it along the boards. There's another for the hit parade. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Calgary's penalty killers get a hold of it. Nice zone entry on the left side. All alone! All the side! Really good effort. I thought it made a, a good play on the net, but the goaltender's right on top of it. 
Who had the edge in Carlin Bain's mind? She's standing by with the answer. Dreisaitl's played a great game, and I really liked his finishing touch, guys. So based on that, I'm giving him the edge in our matchup tonight. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Moves it around along the half wall. Snapper from the slot! Markstrom's gonna smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. McDavid's ready to take the draw here on this power play. Edmonton's got it and they're on the attack. More Good time second. off the clock as they grab the puck. Gotta give the penalty killers a lot of credit as the penalty expires. Well, they can thank their penalty killers as the lead stays the same. They put themselves in a tough spot, but they get bailed out by their PK team. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck. CeCe's taking it from his own end. Textbook stop by Smith. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. A critical draw here. Edmonton's got it in the defensive zone. Moves it to McDavid. He's got a step. Scores! What a finish! That's not a fair fight on the race to get into the clear. He gets out in front of the pack, and he is gone. Finishes it off on the breakaway. Here in the late going to the frame, the Oilers have answered back in these last few minutes, but still need one more to even the score. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Calgary's got it along the wall. All quick work with the stick and comes up with the puck. Trying to gain a step. What a save on the play. What a great play to get in on the goaltender all by himself, but turned away with an excellent save. Oh! And the flames the red A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. Dropped and we are back underway. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And that one's turned away. Edmonton's goalie is on the bench. The extra attacker has jumped into the play. Goes right to the crease. like the Rocket or Mr. Hockey would have done this way back when. No, they wouldn't have done that. It's a regular occurrence now. But now things have changed, and this is what you should do. For my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, my name is James Cebalski. Thanks so much for joining us. Good night. <laughs>